What is up, you guys? Let me turn on some lights. It's your girl, Maite. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know, my name is Maite. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, go ahead and follow me at Maite Bates. And before we move on, your girl is trying to be consistent, as you can see. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you're notified whenever I post because life is life and right now. Anyways, as you guys can see by the title, well, not by the title, but I'm going to let y'all know why the title is the title. But today is October 24th. What was I saying? Anyway, so today's October 24th. Tomorrow's October 25th. And now I can say this. As you can see by the title, your girl has had her first, well, is having her first official hotel partnership. And I've been wanting to start like you know, the whole travel content for since I became a flight attendant, but I kept that a secret for so long that I just delayed a lot of my blessings, to be honest with you. Long story short, I'm just starting the vlog today so you guys could come along for the ride with me. Um, so I'm actually, I just got back from dropping the kids off, filling up the tank in the car, well, the, S the truck, the SUV, going to Walmart, buying a whole bunch of stuff that I was not even supposed to buy, but I ended up buying because I only went there for eggs, bread, and butter. And I ended up buying the kids' fall outfits for their picture day this weekend, well, Friday. And I ended up buying Haley some Christmas outfits so I could just get it out the way so I won't have to stress out. And I also bought her some Encanto dolls for Christmas for her birthday. You guys know Christmas is obviously the 25th of December. Her birthday is January 9th. So we're just getting her a lot of, not a lot of gifts, but we're getting gifts so that we can split between the two days. And let me move. And I saw that and she loves Encanto. So I was like, let me just get her this too because they're the four, four dolls. And I'm gonna show you guys what they look like in a bit. I have my suitcase here that I just brought out from the car so I could unpack and pack some stuff for our trip. So we're leaving tomorrow morning, go about my day and I'll tell you guys all that I have to do today because your girl is busy. All right, you guys, Haley stuff is washing. I am going to unpack my bag, pack my stuff. Right. Packing cubes save lives. You hear me? They help you stay organized and whatnot. But I'm gonna show you guys what I packed for myself. So I cannot wear any like brand, like visible name brand stuff. So I'm packing this white dress. It's supposed to be 84 degrees for the next three days over there. So I'm trying to pack really cute, really lightweight and whatnot so I could take some cute pics and whatnot. I'm also, I think I'm going to wear this dress tomorrow or I really don't know because I do want to be cute for like the pictures once we get there. So I might just go really comfortable and then change into something so Eric could start getting some shots. I'm also bringing this two piece you guys saw in my... Mexico vlog. I don't know if I've uploaded that, but I wore this in Mexico. This two-piece is like a little crop top and some shorts. Um, so I want to keep it very cute, very lightweight. So those are three outfits. Of course, I'm packing some pajamas, some cute sandals, and these that I love. I bought these at Old Navy and they're so comfortable, super comfortable. Of course, some underwear, bathing suit, and this Old Navy little workout piece right here. Um, and actually I need to wax my armpits today. Thank God I left my arms. But I'm packing this just in case they do have a gym because she did say they have a gym. So maybe we could get some shots in the gym or something. I don't know. So I'm packing this and my makeup bag. And that's pretty much, and that's pretty much all I'm packing. Haley's laundry is being washed right now. I'm about done packing, so I'm gonna go ahead and go make breakfast. And I feel like I'm on track. It is only, it's noon. Um, so I feel like I'm pretty much on track and I'll keep you guys in the loop. I'm all packed for me and the kids. That took me not that long. Now it's time to go downstairs. And make this breakfast. Oh, you scared me. What? When you trim my thing, I want you to trim my piece. 
You didn't have no hair, so I still had to. I just want you to make the honey. Here. Okay, well, you need to start putting the Jamaican black castor oil. Hmm? You still look good though. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Heck no. I'm gonna cut it all off. I'm just gonna be bald faced. Heck no. You put the bacon? You guys, I just finished, well, we both just finished eating breakfast. Um, I'm about to start fixing up the bathroom to shoot for this campaign because my bathroom is a mess, obviously. And then I'm gonna do my hair, do a little makeup. I'm actually gonna plug in my wax machine now so that I can wax my armpits so that I won't forget. Um, Anyone else like me, I've already started buying Christmas gifts and hiding them because I don't wanna I don't wanna wait and then feel like I'm spending a lot of money at the same time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um I already know what I want to get Eric. <laughs> I'm not telling y'all because he might watch this vlog and I don't want him to know what I'm gonna get. But um this is gonna be a great Christmas. <laughs> Did I not tell you guys what happened last Christmas? Was it last Christmas? I don't know. It was definitely one of the Christmases. And Eric and I, I we were going through, I guess you could call it a little fin financial rough period. Um, and and um, I thought we agreed on not getting each other gifts. Tell me why I didn't get him anything and he got me something. I can't even remember what he got me to be honest. But he was definitely disappointed. I was laughing but also sad at because we said we weren't gonna get each other gifts and he still got me gifts according to him we didn't agree on that but i've made up for it since for his birthday and father's day and all that good stuff this is gonna be a good christmas for him and for his birthday too his birthday's like right around the corner after that january 16th him Haley, oh my gosh me december 3rd december 23rd christmas our wedding anniversary, Haley's birthday, his birthday are all like in the same time frame and it's just like within a month. That's all within a month. So we're gonna be a little broke, you know what I'm saying? I'm kidding. I don't claim that energy. No broke energy over here. Anyways, look, I already have gifts over here hiding and stuff like that. I came to hide this one. I really have to hide this one because if this little girl comes in here and she sees that, it's over. Anyways, that's that. All right, you guys, hair is done. The bathroom is about, well, my computer is here, but I already fixed everything up. I am working on a Jerkins partnership right now. Not really sure if I could share that now, but this video will most likely be up after after the campaign has gone live. If not, I'll just delete that from there. Anyways, my hair is all done. I am going to find clothes to put on and then we're gonna start taking pictures. I'm not putting on any makeup. I'm not putting on any makeup because this is a very natural lotion campaign. I try not to um, put on makeup. I like makeup, but honestly, the natural, the more natural, the better. So, so yes. Now I'm taking out Haley's laundry. EJ's laundry is almost done. Then it's our laundry. Come on, I'll be doing it. I'll be doing this homemaker thing. My hair looks so cute. This is one of my favorite hairstyles. And now that my hair is relaxed, I can do it. I'm gonna buy me a crimping iron. I used to have one back in the day, but I'm gonna buy me one. You guys, so I'm ready, but my nails look busted. So I'm about to put on these press on nails by Kiss, and they're so cute. All right, y'all, mm, my nails are done. 
because my nails be looking busted in some campaigns. I'm like, I'm gonna press on because better do a little lotion close up so you know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. And if you want to see the box, here's the box. These are a size small or short. And the color is. I don't know. It doesn't have a color. But the color looks kind of off white cream. You know? I didn't do the best because it took me like five minutes, but. <laughs> All right, y'all, let me call Eric so we can start shooting and get this over because he has to leave around four. And I need to put away the kids' laundry before I go pick them up. And that's how my day is going. I don't know what time it is. Let me see. Ooh, it's 142. A little behind the scenes of my personal videographer, photographer getting this footage. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram so you can see the final results. What is up, you guys? <laughs> I have accomplished so much today. I have accomplished so, so much today. Dropping the kids off, filling up the gas tank, went to Walmart, bought the kids fall outfits for their fall photo shoots at school. Freaking came home, made breakfast, did Haley's laundry, did EJ's laundry, did our laundry, folded Haley's laundry, put it away, folded EJ's laundry, put it away. I'm now working on our laundry, folding it. Um, I'm gonna start folding it in a little bit, put it away. Shot some content, Eric edited it already. He sent it to me already. I'm about to upload it to my computer, send it to the brand. I also sent another brand some content. They approved it, they picked the pictures that they want. I'm about to write some captions, edit some stories for that brand, send it to them. Yo, I've been on a roll today. Um, the only thing that is left for me to do is put away our laundry, um, do my hair. What time is it? Oh, it's 4.30, I gotta get my kids soon. So I'm not putting our laundry away now. Um, and I'm not doing my hair now either. I'm just gonna work on this caption and stories really quick and then I'm gonna go pick up my kids. Y'all, I'm on a roll. And then after I put both kids to bed tonight, I will be finishing this laundry, putting that away, my hair, and I'm gonna upload the second part to um, the video for my relaxed hair video. And yes, thanks guys for joining me today. I know I've kind of been not vlogging everything, but I've just been trying to get so much done today. Um, but that's it. All right, y'all, it is I think it's five. <laughs> um, I'm running a little behind on getting my babies. So I am headed there. What time is it? Ooh, it's 5.15. Yikes. I hate getting my babies late. That's just the way it is. Things will never be the same. All right, you guys. I made it to Florida. I am waiting on my Uber now. It's five minutes away, and I just wanted to give you guys a recap of my morning and how crazy it has been. Everything was going perfect until it was time to board. And last night, and you know, it looked like everyone was gonna be able to get on, but every single seat was taken on the plane. So I had to come by myself, and I literally was crying from walking down the gate to Literally walking down the gate up until almost the end of the flight. Up until almost the end of the flight because now I have to shoot everything myself. And I literally was almost having like a panic attack 
because I'm getting paid to do this, you know, and I always want to give great quality and I feel like Eric gives what I like to offer, you know, which is great quality work. So stick around with me, you guys. I am going to try to give you guys, I'm waiting for my Uber, I'm sorry. I'm just going to try to give you guys a bit of, um, Yeah, so that's what happened. I was crying. They had to go back home and I felt so bad because Eric has to go back with both of the kids. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just hate giving him extra work. You know what I'm saying? So that's that and I'm here. I'm supposed to stay until Thursday, but I'm leaving tomorrow. I don't care on what flight, but I'm leaving tomorrow. Um, yeah, and um, well, to another extra night if I can shoot everything today and tomorrow. So that's what I'm gonna do and I'll give you guys an update once I get to the hotel. What is up you guys? I am finally in my room. And to you guys, it may, may not seem like it's been a long time, but it has been. I arrived at the hotel around 12 something around 12 30 p.m um i'm currently exporting all of the footage that i have so far the footage from this video the footage that i'm going to be using for the reel um and i'm finally in my room they took us some time to get my room together because for some reason they thought they think that I work for the hotel. I don't know if they know the difference between an influencer and I guess somebody that actually works for the hotel. So they, you know, wanted to give me like the best, cleanest room. They also, I guess, were a little confused because I came alone and I was supposed to come with my family. So I only have a one bedroom, well, one bed room, right? Anyways, I am done exporting and I just had to relax a little bit I'm about to take a shower and get ready I found someone to shoot my content for tomorrow like I told you guys Eric was supposed to come with the kids however the flight was so full that they were not able to get on the flight with me which had me devastated like crying I literally cried almost the entire flight until I sucked it up worked on my script worked on my script for my voiceover and worked on the script for shooting um you guys know my cousin anna karen if you don't you don't but um i reached out to her and she suggested i used someone really close to her so he is going to come shoot he couldn't come today so we agreed on tomorrow so he's gonna come early at 8 30 in the morning um and we're gonna shoot for about three hours I think it's not even gonna take that long I'm gonna shoot for about three hours max and um, I'm headed on the first flight out that I possibly can get on um because it just only makes sense my family's not here so I have no one to really enjoy this with and I don't really need any alone time I just want to be with my family and my kids for some reason I feel like I've been gone for so long um, but I guess that's just in comparison to being on maternity leave for 14 months you know what i'm saying so to each their own i'm gonna give you guys a little room tour i'll give you guys a room tour now right why not all right so this is what it looks like when you walk in i'm gonna give you guys a bathroom tour first the bathroom is so cute this hotel is so clean it's unmatched um here's the shower really cute I'm about to hop in the shower myself. And then when you come in, you have these hooks, which is so convenient. I don't think I've seen a hotel with hooks. That is a must because you always got something to hang up. And this is the cute little mirror. You guys know outfit of the day. Um, no logo, so your girl got her shell tops on. Jeans from Uniqlo. Hagen Dazs sent me this hoodie. My bag is hanging right here. My tripod is right here. They have this little 
bench thing right here. Then they have a mini fridge. Is anything in here? Nope, nothing in the mini fridge. Um, I have my bag here, my baby shoes. They were supposed to come with me. Um, ooh, more hangers right here, really cool. Ooh, they have an ironing board right here, but I don't see an iron. So, I don't know where the iron is. And then this is the bed. It's supposed to be a noise canceling bed. Really awesome pillows, a really comfortable mattress. I'll let you guys know what I think in the morning when I wake up. A little table right here, a huge TV, um, the AC, and then I have this cute little view. I love it because you know, really bright, nothing too special outside of here. But this is the Avid Hotels, they are fairly new, um, and they are known for. I'll tell you guys right now. <laughs> In my brief, I got you. I got you. Hold on. Being fresh, fair, and frank. All Avid hotels are new build constructions. This one has been open for about nine months, if I recall what the lady told me downstairs. Elizabeth, shout out to Elizabeth. She is such a sweetheart. If you guys ever come to the Fort Lauderdale Avid Hotels location, and let me add, the prices are so so doable. And this hotel is only about 13 minutes from the airport. Like, are you kidding me? The rooms are designed for sound sleep and high quality mattresses, fluffy duvet and linens, firm and soft pillows, blackout roller shades, the ones that you can roll up and down, and noise reducing headboard. I think I said noise canceling, but noise reducing headboard. Um, new clean gyms with a range of cardio weights and training equipment, and I'll show you guys that later on. The latest technology to enable a seamless experience for guests, so you can literally check out like check in and check out like on your phone um as the hotels take care of the hard stuff so that rest is easy um right size guest room this is really good for us well for me and um yeah i'm not about to reach you guys everything but i'll give you guys a little hotel tour later on i'm about to get dressed well i'm gonna take a shower get dressed and um i think i'm gonna go out to eat well, I'm definitely going to go out to eat, but I'm going to work on my stories first and then um, take an Uber and go out to eat because your girl hungry. And I'll be back in a bit. What is up, you guys? It has been quite some time since I shot that footage. I was just ready to get the content done and head back home, so I was not able to give you guys a hotel tour or I did not feel comfortable bringing my camera along to the restaurant so I did not record any of that footage however if you guys do not follow me on Instagram go ahead to my Instagram so you guys can see the final results of the footage shout out to Pee Wee my cousin-in-law and shout out to my husband Pee Wee shot the content Eric edited it I'm just so thankful for this opportunity I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog Sorry about that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram at MyTayBates. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you guys are notified whenever I upload another video. It is a Vlogmas. I will not be posting every day this month, but I will try my absolute best. So much is to come, and I'm so excited to continue bringing you guys content on YouTube. Please let me know what you guys would like to watch, and I will try my best to produce that for you. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.